Hello, I'm Maria the Tool Fox. When operating the CF3000, it is possible to jam the machine by forcing the wire into the insertion funnel too aggressively. If this happens, make sure the clear protective cover is closed. Find the release button on the back of the unit and press it so that the crimp die and forks open to release the wire if needed. Remove the stripping cutters, die, and feeder. Depending on what is jammed, you may need to use needle nose pliers to remove any broken cable pieces. You will notice in your kit that you received replacement locators and replacement cable guides. In most cases, jams cause the blade on the locator to either bend or break, or the jam can deform the feeder. Please note, a jam can cause the fuses to blow. Make sure you always check the fuses located on the back of the machine if the unit is not powering up. Spare part numbers can be found in your manual on page SB-1 and SB-2. If after all these repairs, the unit is still not functioning, your machine is most likely experiencing a more extensive problem and will need to be returned to Phoenix Contact for repair. Please contact your tech services for more information.